In this video, I will be sharing that how to optimize AMD Radeon setting for the gaming and for the best performance. So this is the updated method, updated tweaks working in August 2023. So make sure that you apply all of them. Do not skip any one of the part. And this will be surely helping you to increase the FPS and uh, fix any kind of lagging issues or stuttering. All right. Now, before the starting, I would recommend you that you should go ahead and kindly create a restore point so that by accidentally, if you make any kind of wrong changes, then you can revert the action. So click on your Windows search, type create, choose create a restore point. Now here you have to click on create in case this option is not highlighted. Then you need to click on configure and make sure the system protection has been turned on. Then you can click on apply and OK. And now you can see the create option will be highlighted. And now here you have to give a restore point name. So give a name that you can easily identify that for what purpose exactly you created. So I will type AMD optimization. Then you have to click on create and the restore point will now be created. So once it will be created, you have to close. And then you need to come to this AMD or Radeon website. Now here you have to download the graphic driver AMD Radeon software. So depending which model you are using, you can select your model from here. In order to find your model, you can right click on the Windows icon. Then click on Task Manager. Then click on Performance. Now here in the CPU, you can find your AMD processor name. So according to this, you can search your model number here and in case if you have problem searching over here you can also go and use the auto detect option so click on download windows drivers the downloading will be started so once it will be done you have to click on it then click on yes click on install and the installation will now be started so it will take some time so you will have to keep some patience here and in between you will be getting this kind of page now it says allow amd to collect information to contribute you can make sure this option is unchecked don't allow amd to collect information you can go with the second option and then you have to click on next and then finally click on install and here again you will find all the option that will be downloaded so you can keep all these options checked then you have to click on install again and now the installation will be started and it will take some time so what i will be doing i will be skipping this part and you can easily install it okay so the finally the driver has been installed and once the software will be installed it will ask you to restart so restart the computer then you can make a right click on your desktop and you will be getting amd software adrenaline edition click on it now here you can click on skip this then you will be directly coming to this page now here first you have to click on the gaming section from the top menu option then you have to click on graphics so the first option that is radeon anti-lag you will have to enable this option radeon boost chill you can keep as it is radeon image sharpening you will have to enable this and the sharpness level keep to 80 percent that is fine then look for wait for vertical refresh you can click on the drop down and keep this to always off not recommended then come to the advanced options nt aliasing you have to keep this to use application settings nt aliasing method keep this to multi sampling that is okay texture filtering quality you can change this from standard to performance Surface format optimization, you can enable this option. Tessellation mood, you have to keep this to AMD optimized. Then at the bottom, you'll find reset shader cache. Uh, so if you're using for the first time, then you can leave it. Uh, but if you have been using from a long time, then you can reset the shader cache. All right, then you can come to the display option. Now these settings depend on you that what exactly you want and what you don't. AMD FreeSync if this option support on your computer on your graphic card then you can enable this option. Then you have the HDMI scaling, color depth and the custom color. So these are the options that if you want to change. Display color enhancement you have to disable this option. Uh, rest you can check by your own self that what exactly you need to keep and what to not. 
then from the top menu option click on performance and here make sure the fps option has been checked gpu has been checked cpu has been checked system memory uh you can check this option as well and then click on the setting gear icon that is on the right in top now here you get many options like check for update uh you can disable this option issue detection enable disable the issue detection uh you can disable this option then you have audio and videos you can keep this to default hotkeys if you want to make any changes you can do that md link preferences now in the preferences you have to disable the game overlay web browser advertisement you have to disable it post notification you have to disable it animation and effects you have to disable it all right so these are the settings that you have to apply from the amd radeon software and once you are done now you can close it and next you need to make a right click on the windows icon then you have to click on device manager in the device manager you have to look for system system devices now here you have to disable few option disable few adapters like amd crash defender right click on it and choose uninstall device click on uninstall again come to system devices then you will find amd link controller emulation right click choose uninstall device then you have high precision event timer right click and choose disable device okay you have to disable not uninstall it okay once you are done close it and now finally you will have to download the md radeon fps optimization pack this is updated pack so you have to come to this link the link will be in the description click on download so once it will be downloaded it will be downloaded in a zip file so right click on it then you have to extract it you can choose the location wherever you want to extract then open the extracted folder this is the amd registry optimization that will be uh, making some changes in the registry so don't worry we have already created a restore point so you can go with this and now you need to run this all five registry setting so keep double click on it click on yes yes okay do the same with the second one so once you are done with this part go back now click on the cmd twix number two this is a latency twix so right click on it choose run as administrator then click on yes press any key to continue done now click on this one right click run as administrator yes again go back now go with this one disable ulps double click double click yes yes and okay go back again then click on cleanup and this will be cleaning all the temporary file so again right click choose run as administrator then click on yes hit the continue key and all the temporary file will be deleted again press any key and it will be closed and now you are all set now simply you will have to restart your computer and after that when you will enjoy your game again you will find a great change hopefully guys this optimization guide will surely help you to boost the performance and if you find the difference make sure that you hit the like and subscribe to the channel to stay updated with the next video bye bye